Hey YouTubers, good morning. This is Rob Muffet. Guys, this is about as simple a project as you can make. And it's kind of fun too. The uh, thing we're going to be making is we're going to modify a photography bracket. If you've never had a bracket, it's one of the simplest and, and really most useful items you can buy for your camera, video camera, because it allows you to add uh, lights or microphones, but you can't set it down because it'll fall over. We're going to be putting some feet on it and make it into a mini tripod that can fold up. This allows you to put it on your tabletop or flat surface or put it in your car or do all sorts of things with it. You just need very simple tools. You're going to be using as the raw material a uh, yardstick and a uh, brass quarter inch uh, 20 by 3 quarter inch uh, flathead Phillips screw and a hot glue gun to glue everything together. And like I said, you can use a coping saw to cut the pieces out. I did it with a coping saw, which is not really the best saw to use because that's for cutting curves. But I also use my Rockwell Blade Runner. <laughs> I like using my Rockwell. I made two of these just for fun. And they worked out pretty good. Uh, and they fold up really flat. Don't take up any space. I use a rubber band to tie them on to the bracket. And I can take it with the bracket anywhere it goes. And you'd be surprised how handy this is. Because you can use any flat surface. But you could also take some of those neomidium magnets and put it in the bottom and secure it. That way you could stick it to metal if you wanted to. I just thought this was a real handy project. Something simple. If you've never been making any do-it-yourself stuff before, this might be something handy you could start with. I found out that the uh, little mount fits in my car. It'll fit on my dashboard with the cloth, but also it fits in my um, cassette player because I have an ancient 100-year-old car <laughs> that has cassettes. <laughs> uh, you may, you, your, your miles may vary. You may have to use a different slot in your car, but uh, it fits in the slot fine in mine. Maybe you fit in your air-conditioned vent. But... Like I said, I made two of these. I also used my Rockwell Blade Runner and uh, the hot glue gun and glued these up. They're about five inches long. And you just cut the short pieces about one and three quarter inches and drill a hole in the center. I used a drill bit that was a little bit smaller than a quarter inch so the threads would bite into the wood. It wouldn't fall out. And uh, that's about it. I did paint it. You don't have to put primer on it. It's kind of rustic. I didn't make it perfect. Um, I just use regular household uh, Rust-Oleum paint, and I like it. it. It it's real handy, and it allows me to to use the GoPro or, or the, in this case I'm using a light dial, but you could use other small video cameras, and it would work fine with this. Like I said, if you've never had a bracket before, they're real cheap. I'll leave a link to it on Amazon in the video description below the video. You can get one for like six or seven bucks. They're dirt cheap, and they make really stable video when you're using them, when you walk around with them. It, it allows you to hold the camera real steady and take good shots with your video and your cameras. So that's about it for this video, guys. There's not much more to say. It's just making three cuts. You got four pieces of wood, put a hole for the bolt, put some glue on there, some paint, and you're done. And like I said, you can use it for a lot of different things. And you can make the other video uh, makers jealous of you having such a, an amazing... <laughs> uh, they'll be jealous of you walking around with this gear. They've never seen anything like it. It is kind of cool. I haven't seen anybody else on YouTube make this. I like doing stuff nobody else has made. Well, guys, I'm going to stop rambling here. Go to the, uh, the video description. I'll have a link to the playlist of other video stuff I've made to uh, make gadgets for video cameras. You might be uh, finding something there useful and, and handy where you could make. Well, the video is almost over here. All right, guys. Take care and uh, see you out there. And thanks for watching and subscribing. And watch my videos. I put new stuff on every week.
Oh, when you turn it upside down, it looks like a cross in case you do any vampire movies or have to do an exorcist. <laughs> uh, an exorcism. All right. Bye-bye.